Puppeteers, it's Christina J back at it with another video. So for today's video, I wanted to do kind of a natural makeup look for you guys. And uh, the closest I think I've ever gotten to a natural makeup look is probably the back to school video. I'll link that down below if you're interested in looking at that. But when it comes to makeup, I'm kind of a no makeup person or full glam. There's really no in between, so I kind of wanted to try and dial it back a little bit and go straight down in the middle. So if you're interested in that, then please watch the video. I'm gonna do today is prepare my face for the makeup process and I usually do this by using my Olay Complete Daily Moisturizer. While I do this, I kind of do want to talk to you guys about the changes that are happening with my channel right now. So as you guys may have noticed, I have been posting more often. I posted last Saturday and I am doing this because I have more time right now considering that I'm on winter break from school and also because I wanted to do more especially during the holiday season kind of as a holiday special that a lot of youtubers like to do so if you are interested in keeping up to date with that then please hit that subscribe button because I do plan on posting two to three videos a week and these will be kind of different videos. I don't want to do all holiday looks because that can get really boring really fast. So I want to do challenges, collaborations, and many other videos. Maybe some holiday videos too, just to keep it interesting. I don't know, but if you want to keep a lookout for that, please do so I can do that for you guys. Next, I'm going to go in with the Professional Pore Primer. This primer is really great because it smooths out all my pores so I can apply a good base the foundation on, up on top of it. Next, I'm going to go in with another primer. This is the Milk Hydro Primer. This primer it has a really sticky feeling, so when I put my foundation on top of this, it really does adhere to it and make sure that it lasts all day long. For my foundation today, I'm gonna go in with my Fenty Beauty foundation. For natural looks, this is pretty natural for me because I really do like that full coverage feeling but if you are kind of like me and kind of are looking for a middle ground and you don't want to use a BB cream because that's too light for you then this is a good medium place and I really do like how it applies. One small thing about it is that it does dry up pretty quickly um, but I found that working in sections really does help that. Concealer today, I'm also going in with a lighter touch than the Juvia's Places concealer. So I'm using my ColourPop No Filter Concealer. I am still really in love with this, so I'm just gonna apply that in my normal spots today. Now I'm going to go in with my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder just to make sure that it does stay on there all day. Next step is for me to do my eyebrows, so I'm going to be doing those off camera. My eyebrows are done, so it is time to prime my lips and I'm going to go in with my Bite Beauty Lip Primer. For 
my natural look today i'm not really going to be doing anything with my eyes that much the only thing i'm going to do is going in with my benefit bad girl bang mascara and just coating my lashes That is really all I'm going to be doing on my lashes and my eyes today, except maybe I might be popping some highlight in the inner corner and a brow bone. So the whole point of natural makeup is for me to just kind of add more to my natural features. And I don't really have that long of a lash, so this is really the best I can do without adding some falsies on. So that is why I don't really like my lashes, but it's fine for today because we're doing a natural look. Now we're just going to move on to our cheeks and I'm going to do my hula bronzer all over the place. Now it's time to put on some blush. I'm just using my Milani Coral Coral Blush and putting it on the apples on my cheeks. And for highlight today, I'm just gonna go into the Ofra Signature Palette. I'm just gonna grab this brush and dip into this middle color here. I think it's really pretty. I don't know why I chose it. I just wanted to try it. Now I'm going to blend the cheeks out with my Total Face Brush. And to finish off the look today, I'm going to be going in with my Maybelline Nude Flush Lipstick. So I've been recently watching this show called Glow Up on Netflix and it's about all these makeup artists, well wannabe makeup artists, and they come and compete with each other. and. I learned a lot of things just from watching that. It was so interesting. I binged it in a day, maybe two, but it was just so interesting. One of the tricks that I learned from applying lipstick from the show is you go in with your lipstick first, and then you go in with a lip liner and just fix it up, and then you add the gloss. So I'm gonna be trying that out today. All right, the lip is done. I think it turned out pretty well. Anyways, the show is really, really interesting and I definitely recommend watching it because I did learn a lot. The only thing is that makeup is an art and I don't know, there was just a lot of differing opinions about techniques and stuff. And I think that it's really interesting. There's certain ways that you can make things look better, but I don't think there's makeup rules. So I don't know. But it was just a really, really interesting show and I definitely recommend watching it if you love makeup. So to finish off the look for real this time, um, I'm going to be going in with my ColourPop Rose Quartz Crystal Priming Spray. I say it all the time, but I never say it without stuttering. And that is the final look for today. I think this is pretty natural. You guys might not, but I think this is really, really natural, especially for me. So if you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and also comment down below for future video ideas or whatever ideas you want to see during this holiday season. Don't forget to hit subscribe to stay up to date with my makeup adventure. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>